I meet a lot of great people down here. Uh, we certainly are, are able to, to form very strong relationships, um, help strengthen our relationship with research and motion. And of course, uh, on a very technical level, um, I find a lot of the sessions very helpful. Some of the new uh, BlackBerry 6 APIs, uh, the new BlackBerry Messenger program, all of those things. The, uh, the biggest thing was the fact that everything is there. It's finally integrated from start to finish, from carrier billing to social platform and you know being able to access this stuff in any way possible. We owe a lot of our success to BlackBerry Developer Conference. In 2008 we came down, uh, won the developer competition and ever since then we've been back every year. I was amazed at the keynote to just see the room full of developers and to see the cheering and the clapping when certain announcements were made and it's just great to see that level of enthusiasm for the BlackBerry platform growing every year and the opportunities that are now being presented to the developers to monetize and to build apps in new ways and be way more creative on the platform is very exciting. The opportunity to form relationships and to get that high technical level of knowledge that you need to turn your app into a super app and make it truly successful is all right here. So we're really excited about the new payment service. It's all about monetizing apps. We, like a lot of developers, have struggled to monetize our apps during the download process. But what Payment Service does for us is it enables us to monetize our app within the app. When the user's using it, at that point when they really want to buy something, we can now do that with Payment Service. Specifically towards the advertising SDK, um, well, we're obviously really excited about that because we're a free application. And uh, so we were able to uh, now leverage that to monetize our application and I think it's going to be really great for the developer community in general because it's really going to pull a ton of new developers to the platform and I think that's something we all need to be excited about. A couple other new announcement is the, uh, that we're pretty excited about is the Ad API. So Ad API allowed us to uh, monetize some of our free application um, you know, that are utility based and um, that's going to be pretty exciting for us. What I'm most excited about is some of the BBM stuff that's rolling out especially for the idea that, you know, Foursquare, even though it's very much location-based, it's all about connecting to the people that you know, what's close, and your social network. And BBM is, you know, essentially that. No matter where you are, you can talk to people, you can share all this information instantly with the people that matter to you. What I think is amazing about the playbook is a couple of things. First of all, it runs the QNX operating system. So that gives developers way more scope to be creative in building great apps. And secondly, the playbook is cool because it's an extension of the BlackBerry. So it's not a separate, unconnected device. It actually links seamlessly with the existing base of BlackBerry users. I think the playbook is awesome. I think that it's a really cool platform and the concepts are great. The playbook is going to change BlackBerry as we know it, um, especially the QNX. Um, I think having something that's very whiz-bang and flash at the same time I can tether to my device and get into my corporate email or for that matter show our applications and show our interfaces on is awesome. Uh, the playbook is a very slick device.